The president and founder of Achinze, Charles Obiodogu Foundation, Mr. Charles Obiodogu, says in the celebration of Christmas, they are extending goodwill to over 50 to 100 widows in Okmanam and Iguza communities in Oshimili South local government area of Delta State. Obiodogu made the statement at the handing over ceremony of the house to the family of late Emeka Nwe Dozie, a former chairman of Vigilant of Opanam community who died in active service. Plus TV's Asaba correspondent Akbomejero Friday reports that Charles Obiodogo says he was worried about the condition of late Nwe Dozie's wife being homeless with five children. I was informed that where she's living was not nice and um, they have even given her a quick notice and she is homeless with five children. So when I look at it, I was so troubled. Going to Ebuza, we are going to be affecting about um, 50 to 100 widows and the less privileged. Uh, when I called the, the lady in question, I told her if she, the husband has any 50 by 100 or 50 by 50, where well, we can be able to erect a structure. And she said no, but the, there is a small property which they buried the husband. That I think I can do something there. So let's give that to a five were learned by instruction from him and also by body language. Most times, it cannot be forgiven. I remember one time, my younger brother, my sister, Charles Ogoro, they told me that God spoke to me that I should give them a beautiful apartment to the widow. And I asked him, are you sure he said yes? And I, when he told me I have known that God was only speaking with him, was speaking to him, and uh, we gave him go ahead, and we gave him some back. We encouraged him. No, it wasn't easy, but today he has done it, and I want to keep going on the face. Honestly, I'm sort of aware, but with that being told, I'm very much aware that Charles will be able to come from that. I've been a humanitarian, you know, for him to come up with this idea of building a beautiful device. So, uh, a widow, the wife of late, make a widow here, you know, bringing happiness to her life. You know, like what she, what he said to them before now, that giving is something that is not the hands. Giving is not the numbers of money that you have in the bank account. It doesn't necessarily mean that you must have for the hotel or host all over the whole place. It's something that is important. In 2020, when my husband died, it was not easy for us. Things were so rough. Challenges here and here. But today, God is faithful. All the whole accommodation issue here and here already now fighting. Because you know it's not easy, it's not a long journey, it's not an easy journey. But oh God is faithful. And I want to thank God so for using my son to meet Brother Cheesy. And they talk as a father, as a son. From that process, he decided to help us and he gave us a good accommodation without not paying one another outside anymore. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.